Hi guys, Viv coming live from York. Um, so I'm just doing a very, very quick live. Um, top tips on dealing with anxious thoughts. Um, I've learned some of these things by going to various things in the past, but I just thought I'd do some very quick tips. Um, so one of the ones I really like is the idea that if you start getting in your head, which sometimes all of us do, is just to stop. And the acronym for that is, I'm just going to do, so stop, take a breath, observe how you're feeling and proceed. So sort of if it's an anxious thought or you're getting too much in your head or you're beginning to worry about stuff, it's just to stop and then take a breath, which means you're paying attention. Um, observe what you're thinking, maybe go, is that true? I'm not sure. Does it really matter? Is it going to help me with what I'm going to do today? Blah, blah, blah. Does it need to be dealt with now? That sort of thing. And then sort of let it go and proceed. Um, another one, if it's something that you really can't get rid of, is to use all five senses. So sometimes when we're too much in our head, it's good to actually stop. So like the stop thing, but maybe just take a moment to look around you. You know, just observe what's around you, especially if you're outside. You know, look at the trees, look at the sky, actually get out of your head by using your um, eyes. And then maybe smell if you're outside. I mean, even if you're inside, there's always smells around a house, especially if someone's cooking. So actually do that sort of thing. Use your sense. Maybe just touch your own hand or if you're outside, actually feel the air on your skin or across your face or whatever. Um, so that sort of thing where you're using your senses, which means you're getting out of your head. Oh, hello. Sorry, didn't notice people have joined. Hello, Zach. Hello, Jackie. Um, sorry, I did see, smell, feel, taste. So yeah, actually observe what's going on in your mouth. That might not be quite such a pleasant one. And then stop and listen. You know, there's always sounds around. But hopefully someone giggling somewhere that might just make you smile or... Um, you'll hear a bird or some, something that will just take you out of your head. Hi, Ruth. Um, and actually get you away from your brain because sometimes our brains just overwork. So using all five senses is a really good tip of getting out of your brain and getting away from those anxious thoughts. Um, the other thing I really like is obviously smell is one of the senses. And smell does go straight to the brain and have very um, relaxing um, it's one of the senses that goes straight to the brain. So if you've got something that smells really nice, and obviously I'm into essential oils, so I carry a little cutie pouch which has got essential oils in it. So I'd take one of those out, a really cute little bottle. You know, take the lid off, you literally just need to smell it. And again, it's making you take a deep breath, which opens up your airways, which always gets everything moving a bit more. Again, out of your head, because suddenly you're thinking, oh, that's a really nice smell. Pick a nice smell, obviously. Um, but Seeing as I am a bit lazy, to be honest, what I do is I quite often wear a little diffuser necklace. So I've got various ones of these, all with different oils on. Um, and it's got a little thing that you can put oils on on the inside. Um, so I just choose which one I want to wear. But obviously you can take the thing out and put a different oil on it. And the oils affect emotions and physical stuff because, as I said, they go straight. They have a... a portion in the brain that goes straight in there within like five seconds and then it affects the chemistry of your body. So this is my really lazy way of taking you out. If you're having an anxious thought, you can suddenly, it does look a bit weird, but hey, turn around, take a smell, gets you out of your brain and hopefully away from those anxious thoughts. So those are my tips from the top. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care. Bye.